Bob Sogger. Ivy Masters Learning Center and IvyMasters.com. And today we're going to look at the ninth question from the Digital SAT Test 1 Module 2. It's from the Blue Book app, the harder set of math questions. Number 9 reads, Circle A in the XY plane has the equation x plus 5 quantity squared plus y minus 5 quantity squared equals 4. Circle B has the same center as circle A. The radius of circle B is 2 times the radius of circle A. The equation defining circle B in the xy plane is x plus 5 quantity squared plus x minus 5 quantity squared equals k, where k is a constant, what's the value of k? So in order to get this question correct, what you need to know is you need to either just throw it into decimals, which is um, one uh, example. You could mess with the k, but really you got to know standard form of a circle. So it's like this, x minus h quantity squared plus y minus k quantity squared equals r squared. So here xy is an endpoint, meaning it's a, perf a point on the circumference of the circle. HK is the center. It tells you that they, they have the same center. Notice it says plus 5, minus 5. So x plus 5 quantity squared, x minus 5 quantity squared for both. So the center would be negative 5, 5 in that case because it's minus h minus k. And the center is positive h, positive k. R squared is the radius. So that's what this question is asking about. R squared is isolated on the right. 4 is isolated on the right. In other words, r squared equals 4. And if you take the square to both sides, r equals 2. So this equation has a radius of 2, which means this equation has a radius of 4. And once again, since r squared is isolated on the right, if it equals k and it equals r squared and your radius is 4, then it equals 4 squared. Actually, I'm a little off screen over here. So it equals 4 squared, which is 16. It's going to be your answer. Thank you for joining us today. If you like this video, click like. You can share it with someone who does not know the standard form for circle. If there's any question you'd like to answer from any official PSAT or SAT or ACT, leave that in the comments. I'd be happy to shoot a video on it. Click subscribe so you don't miss anything and check out that one-minute video on TikTok. Have a great day.